So what's the state of the alternative scene? It's not really that good. It's, uh, let's see. There's Vidly right now, which seems to be the most popular. Um, well, I mean, the most fastest growing, I guess. Um, there's Wienu. There is Upload Society. Oh, wait, no, that's Upload Stars. So what's Upload S Oh. Uh, which is pretty much dead right now. And there is the last one, Silvervid, which nobody uses, but at the same time, it was only created like 10 or 20 days ago, so... So Vidly is pretty much the closest you're going to get to 2007 YouTube currently um, without using Wienu, which is pretty much absolutely dead um, and needs an admin, by the way, so if you want to. Um, Wienu does it. Basically, um, Vidly is the fastest growing one right now. If you don't count Vidme, which I don't, uh, I don't really have an account on it, but it's not the worst thing in the world. It's does pretty good for 2006 YouTube, that's for sure. 2006, 2007, I mean, um, eh, it's join it if you want to find an alternative website. Uh, it's pretty good. It's pretty much. It's pretty much Vidbit. Like Vidbit used to be, I mean. I, that would probably be helped by the fact that it literally is, but. Yeah. Right, but what are the features? The features are. Um, let's see. Cha there's Channel 2.0 already. Uh, you, you rate out of. You rate with stars. So you have five stars you can rate. Uh, basically, there aren't really that many unique features. Um, but the ones that they do have are all done pretty well. But there is a 350 megabyte uh, upload limit. We knew it was very feature dense. You got uh, audio sharing, which is perfect for people who have podcasts. You have video uh, video sharing, obviously. You have image sharing. You have channel 2.0. You have supreme channel customization. This is the best website for channel customization. Only problem is nobody ever actually goes on the website. Um, you have a one gigabyte a week upload limit, which I think is actually better than a... Um, hard video upload limit because you can upload bigger videos and just keep your audience tied over until the next video you uh, end up making which you know quality over quantity and all that um, and it's only a week between uh, each gigabyte upload anyway which is you know if you have a weekly hour long podcast or you know whatever six hours long that takes a gigabyte to store then you can do just do that every week anyway, so that's pretty good. Makes me wonder where he's getting all the storage space from now that you think about it. It's a solid video website, and I would join it. Uh, if you're looking for a video sharing website that has a bunch of features, but not that many users.